We begin today with Matt Damon. The Stillwater star is in hot water after revealing that he only recently stopped using an offensive anti-LGBTQ slur. Yeah, Matt gave a lengthy interview over the weekend with the UK Sunday Times. The combo turned to the shifting landscape of Hollywood and cultural sensibilities as well as changes in modern masculinity. That's when Matt shared an exchange between he and his daughter where she called him out for using what she called, quote, the F slur for a homosexual, an offensive term that Matt says, quote, he has now retired. Matt said, quote, I made a joke months ago and got a treatise for my daughter. She left the table. I said, come on, that's a joke. I said it in the movie Stuck on You. She went to her room and wrote a very long, beautiful treatise on how the, world is, how the word is dangerous. I said, quote, I retired the F slur, I understood. Matt was referencing a scene from the 2003 movie that he starred in with Greg Kinnear. Yeah, that's right. The actor went on to mention to the UK's The Sunday Times that the word was commonly used when he was a kid. The Oscar winner quickly drew criticism on social media with many questioning his use of the word in the first place and why it took him so long to realize how offensive the word is. Matt explained he was still using the word as recently as a few months ago, which is also something a lot of people had a lot of issues with. Yeah. Some also wondered why he shared the story to begin with, with one Twitter user even asking, has Matt Damon just canceled himself? Uh -huh. What do you think? Has he just canceled himself? I want to know your reaction. You're a member of the LGBTQ plus mm -hmm. community. What are your initial thoughts when you hear this? My initial thought is simple. Why even share the story? Or why even share how recently you used it? Mm -hmm. um, you know, because funny enough, in that same interview, Matt also talks about how he has learned over the years to keep his mouth shut or to yes. say less in interviews for the fear of it getting picked apart by the media. And, you know, you can't blame him. Uh, he, he talks a lot about clickbait and how people will take quotes out of context now. He compared it to music. It's less about music and now people are picking apart the lyrics, right? Mm. The words. And so in that, to say that in that same interview and, and then, then to shoot yourself flip. in the foot, exactly, it makes no sense to me. That's the part where I'm like, make it make sense. Yeah, it's unacceptable, yeah. flat out. I always try to look for the silver lining in things. Right. I think that as a world, you know, we can take a, a lesson out of his daughter's book. Right. Uh, if you see something that offends you, it's okay to get upset and step away come back with knowledge and information mm. to share with that person mm. so they can change their beliefs, their mind. You get what I'm saying? Because there, unfortunately, there are a lot of men out there like Matt and women who are loose at the mouth with that word and right. still feel like it's okay. And that's the, I feel like we're at this turning point in culture where it's all about unlearning. He mm -hmm. says it's a word that they frequently used as a kid. He used it in a movie that we all saw, we've all seen, you know? Um, and so you're right, it is about education. And I also like to believe that in the greater context of the story and in the interview, it was him talking about how those sensibilities are not only changing right. in the culture, but it's impacting Hollywood too, and the stars at the helm of these big movies, you know? Yeah. And so I, I, I don't wanna say go as far as to say it was irresponsible of what he said. Mm -hmm. I think it's a, a learning, uh, thing for him. You know, it's a moment that he, I think he won't take lightly yep. and will learn and do better from. Hopefully. 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 Look, actions speak louder than That's words. That's right. Well, ET has reached out to Matt's rep for further comment.